Hello, welcome back to the channel. Another video from my ZX6RJ2. Video today I'm going to be balancing the carbs. So let's get on with it. I'll have to remove the tank, the air box, uh, so we can get to the carbs. And uh, yeah, let's see how we get on with this. I bought this, which is what I'll be using to sync them up. Hopefully it goes well. All right, then. So that is top of the carburetors. Fantastic. Yeah. So four cylinders, four carburetors, one for each. Um, one, two, three, and four. There. The idea is we can balance up the left two together with a screw that's under there and the right two together with another screw that's there and once each of them are balanced we could then balance the two pairs with a screw in the middle okay so we've got this let's push it into there i'll we'll have to look for the reading see what it is on there see what it is on there and then by turning that screw it's going to open the valve in one of these whilst closing the valve in the other or vice versa depending on which way you turn the screw if that makes sense so what i'll do then i'll get the bike started get it up to temperature uh, then we'll start the process so this is the setup we've got now um obviously with tank off needed a way to supply fuel so rigged up a fuel line there off the fuel filter. I'll replace that fuel filter. I have ordered one. It's probably the original, but not for this video. I'll just do that when it comes. But yeah, there's the line. It comes up to a funnel. Um, I'll fill that with fuel. And then like you do, you use what you can get hold of. And it's uh, <laughs> the wife's ironing board. So here we go. Put some super unleaded in here. go I'll keep an eye on that as well just to keep topping it up I don't know how much it's going to use for this process price of fuel as well uh, V power that was from Shell 10 quid to fill that ridiculous alright then start the bike get it nice and warm A bit of choke. Three or four minutes to get to the 
right temperature before we start this.
long three. These two being in two and a half, so I'll simply just synchronise these two now. So with that pair to that pair. That's it there done. I'll put everything back together. That was uh, pretty straightforward, pretty easy with that device. Um, just one thing to be careful of as you were as I was turning the adjustment screws, you have to be very careful not to push on them as you were turning them because that increased the revs as well. So yeah, just um, turn it with light pressure. I'll give this a clean as well because I think this is going to be full of flies. Yeah, there's a few in there. I'll give that a clean. Well. job done nice and easy balancing the carbs um, using that device that's it there um, yeah it just made it so straightforward there was no need to cut any of the vacuum tubes that you would on the the standard ones with the four dials or the four vials of liquid um, yeah it was really straightforward uh, certainly recommend one of these 50 quid off Amazon uh, yeah, made it great and easy, no problem at all. Um, they were quite a bit out, I'd say. Uh, the left two weren't synced together. They were around between two and two and a half, I think, weren't they? Um, the others were a bit lower, but certainly the perfect after that. But time will tell. We'll soon see uh, when I get out on a ride if it made much of a difference, um, whether it's noticeable or not, I don't know. But yeah, that's it, done. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please press the like button and uh, please do subscribe if you like my channel. Thank you.